Hey folks, welcome back to another video. Okay, so today I'm bringing you guys some stickers from Panini 2021. We got the stickers and a card apparently. Five stickers and one card per pack. I got four packs. So, while I get lucky to pull a Lamello, I honestly don't know. I haven't seen much about these stickers. Uh, I know that uh, people are buying the Lamello rookie sticker cards and all that type of stuff so I'm not really sure uh, what are the odds of pulling those uh, doesn't say nothing on the back this is what the back looks like but yeah I'm gonna give it a try I haven't opened stickers in a long time I remember I did some of my early videos with cards and stuff it was the Panini uh, World Cup or Road to the World Cup orange yearbook do you guys remember those it was a few years ago when they had the last world cup and also the actual um one of the teams that made it to the world cup so they had like two different i don't know two different formats or types of year uh yearbooks they had two different variations um and um yeah i didn't really finish if some of you guys are wondering if i ever finished uh those yearbooks i did not i was Kind of close to completing the Road to the World Cup, but it was just too many stickers, man. <laughs> just a lot of them, so I don't know, maybe in the future I'll make a, a little update video on that. But uh, stickers are, are not, you know, the best, at least, at least they're probably the least favorite, I, I should say, when it comes to uh, collecting. Uh, these are most popular in South America and those countries, especially back in the 90s. I remember I used to have a friend, a neighbor, some kid that used to um, I used to go to his house to play sometimes when I was a kid and he had a whole bunch of stickers like from different teams, like soccer teams and stuff. And um, a lot of them were actually, um, I guess, like players like Pelé and legendary players, uh, Maradona, so um, I'm pretty sure some of those are pretty rare nowadays, but um, yeah, they're quite popular in those countries, so you never know who's going to be interested in this stuff. Alright, let's go open these and see what I get, maybe a lamello. I already see something shiny there, hopefully something really nice. And the thing about these, and this is from experience, the first one that I opened uh, these like type of stickers like the soccer ones when you take these out and then obviously you pull them out um, and then you you close them like this you know you press down to the to the pack for some reason this thing seals back it's kinda it's kinda like a magnet I don't know it's kinda weird I think oh okay so it must be some sort of adhesive I guess kinda feels uh, sticky but yeah so let's see what I get from here first we got a Steph Curry looks like a firework design variation it's pretty nice uh, Tyus Jones next we got an Alfred Payton another fireworks one Bradley Beal Pascal Siakam and a Julius Randle pretty cool Julius Randle uh, right there I don't think the cards a sticker let me see I don't know I don't want to mess with it maybe it is not sure but we'll just leave it there let's see let's open it from here I don't want those uh the cart not the card the uh, pack collectors to give me a strange look like what is he doing he's opening the wrong way <laughs> I know that's it's probably not the proper way, but hey, how else would you open these? I mean, all right, we got more shiny ones. Julius Randall. We got a Raptors team logo, and this is what the back looks like, by the way. I don't know if you guys are into the Panini Dunk, but there's a couple coats. You guys want to get them? Patrick Williams, fourth overall pick, pretty nice. And Al Horford. Andrew Wiggins. And we got a K Love for the card. Alright. Let's 
So, pretty cool. I really like these uh, firework ones. They look pretty nice. All right, third pack. You gotta be extremely careful with these because you can easily <laughs> rip some of the stickers. I know it happened with the, the soccer ones at one point. All right, hopefully pull a Lamello out of these last two. Mm, a Team LeBron. All right, something, something nice at least, pretty decent. Jeremy Lamb, Pacers, Fireworks. A Jimmy Butler, Jimmy Buckets. A Terrence Davis and a cat for the cart. So, last one. All right, let's see what we get. So far, only one rookie. That's not looking good. I guess if you really want a Lamelo, you would have to buy the whole entire box. All right, come on. All right, so the card obviously it's Persingas. Not gonna show it until the end. You guys already know. All right, let's see what we got. Three twenty-six. That's gonna be a Warriors <laughs> team logo. One hundred and ten. Trey Young. Number ten. Who's gonna, who's gonna be? A oh, LeBron James. All right, I'll take that for the PC and. 12 is going to be, okay, so, Nobi, don't know who the other guy is, but 118, it's a Boston Celtics card, which, I don't see any Celtic players here, pretty interesting, and the last one, it's a Zion Williamson, second sophomore year, so, um, I can say these stickers are pretty fun. I mean, at, at least if you're trying to collect stuff, or maybe you're trying to complete the uh, uh, the yearbook. Other than that, um, it is what it is. You, you gotta continue hunting if you really want the Lamello, or you can just buy it off. You know, just buy from someone, single sticker, whatever, without buying all these packs. Because um, obviously, we don't know the odds of pulling those guys, the top rookies. So. Uh, with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed this video. For those of you who are not familiar with the next giveaway, it's going to be an NBA Hoops thin pack, 30 cards, possible slams, uh, you never know. I know those are really popular right now. Um, possible Lamelo, um, you never know. Uh, it could be something big, um, autograph, you name it. But um, I'm going to be giving away one of those. Uh, the giveaway will be this Friday, and all you got to do is like the video, I'm going to link it up and also uh, be a subscriber to the channel if you haven't subscribed yet. So you have to hashtag part-time or full-time. If you haven't seen the video, check it out. You guys will know what I'm talking about. So, With that being said, thanks for watching this video. See you later, guys.